Hey YouTubers, um, this is uh, Charles Young again, also known as Open Thoughts, coming back at you again. Um, I wanted to go over a little bit of some things that we don't know and we don't really understand is uh, the subconscious mind and the conscious mind. What are the difference between both of them? Um, I've always heard the saying that a lot of people say, if the brain is so powerful, why do we only use 10% of it? And what they're speaking on is their conscious mind, the, the motion, the moving, the actual doing part um, like if I want to grab a cup of water or you know what I'm saying we're using we're not using the best part of our mind even though we we're using it we just don't understand that we are using our subconscious mind um, I like to learn a little bit about you know both things when it comes to the subconscious and how powerful it is you know that's 90% of your um, your greatest power in your brain um, what a lot of people don't know how powerful the subconscious mind is. Let me give you some examples of what it controls and what it gives you. Um, let's see. It controls your memory because it's like a computer. Um, you know, your relationship patterns, your addictions, your habits, um, your creativity, which is very important, uh, your development stages in life, your spirituality, your spiritual connection. Uh, your intu intuition and your imagination um, also your emotions so emotions and feelings so you gotta understand like your subconscious mind is a very big thing that's why I believe you people should not lose their child side we get so stuck into these jobs that we kinda forget to be feel free to be us again to be a child because a child has no cares in the world you know and you have to even though you may have cares you can't think about them you can't dwell on them because you're losing your creativity side you don't want to lose it you don't you're losing your connection with your subconscious you're only programming logic logical things into your subconscious mind that's not what you quite want to do you want to leave that for the conscious mind to deal with you you, you want to be expressive you want to use that part of your brain the subconscious mind is amazing thing I've programmed so many things in my head I program I'm a millionaire in my head and I know it's gonna happen I, I, I know everything that I want is going to happen you know because I've seen it happen over and over again I you know I'm going after AC refrigeration right now man it's program my head I wanted a radio show man it program I wanted some food you know you can program these things in your head quickly and fast and it'll happen it'll happen you just you all you have to do is still stay a tied to your subconscious mind you should study it man study it learn about it man it's the most beautiful thing you ever ever know shoot is it, it's amazing it I can't tell you how amazing it is only you can research and study it and see how important your subconscious mind is in, in creation and life and living and how you need to keep that your adolescent side um, and use and dwell upon that you know stop dwelling stop stressing about the stuff things are going to happen you know they want you to be logical they want you to think logical you know it's it's not gonna help you know so uh, you know, this is my video. Uh, you know, I'll probably do a part two about this because it's very important. It's very important to know your your subconscious and conscious mind. So go check it out. Go on a video. You know, also go on my page, watch some of my videos, keep you laughing. You know, uh, may brighten your day. So thank you for watching. You know, stay happy, live happy, and always be you.